Welcome back to Screens and Dream, the place where student developers learn to build real-world projects using modern tools and AI. I'm Mohammed Gibran Rehan, a passionate full-stack developer, class 10 student, intern at Combine Foundation, and an active learner at GEC. This is an AI-generated educational coding series, and you're watching Day 3 of 7 Days of Coding with Next.js. Today we're focusing on Tailwind CSS styling in Next.js. Tailwind is a utility-first CSS framework that allows us to build beautiful, responsive interfaces without writing traditional CSS. Let's start by installing Tailwind CSS NPM install D Tailwind CSS post CSS auto prefixer NPX Tailwind CSS is in it. P then update tailwind.config.js to include the following paths, content, slash app slash rjs test js tsx. Finally add these lines to your globals.css dash at tailwind base at Tailwind Components, at Tailwind Utilities. Let's now style a basic layout using Tailwind. Why use Tailwind CSS? Faster UI development, utility-based equals less messy CSS, mobile responsiveness out of the box, dark mode support, easy to customize and scale. You've now successfully integrated Tailwind CSS into your next.js project and styled your first page. You're building professional UIs with clean, maintainable code. Coming up in day four, we'll explore dynamic routing. How to create dynamic pages using slug and catch all routes with the app router. That's it for today's video. If you liked today's video, please comment hash coding with Gibran and like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I love reading your feedback and questions, so drop them below. Thanks for watching and keep coding.